Hi, I'm Jake Patino, and I help Filipinos understand how the game of wealth works so that they can achieve financial freedom and abundance. Lahat naman tayo gustong yumaman at maging successful. Whether that means owning your own car or home, or sending your children to good schools, or traveling around the world, retiring young and retiring comfortably. We all want to have enough money so that we no longer have to worry about money. And to have enough time so that we can pursue our passions in life. Whether that's painting, dancing, playing sports, or simply spending time with the people we truly care about. Unfortunately, only a few people actually get to do it. Maraming may gustong yumaman, pero kaunti lang ang nakakagawa. Bakit kaya? This is the reason why I made this video. Because there are three important facts that need to be acknowledged by everyone when it comes to money. Number one, money is a part of everyone's life. Kahit sino, kahit saan ang pera ay naging parte na ng buhay ng bawat tao. Number two, unfortunately, only a handful of people teach how the game of wealth works. Sobrang kakaunti lang ang nagtuturo kung paano gumagana ang investments, credit cards, compounding, negosyo at iba pa. Number three, because no one is teaching it, many Filipinos are financially illiterate. Mali o kulang na kulang ang alam tungkol sa pera. Kaya marami ring financial problems. I have made it my life's mission to teach you along with many other Filipinos how to win in the game of wealth. Kung paano manalo sa laro ng kayamanan. And so in this video, you will learn three very important lessons. First is the reason why so many people are struggling financially. We need to first understand what's causing the problem before we can solve it. Mahirap solusyonan ang isang bagay na hindi natin naiintindihan, di ba? The second part of this video is you learn what is the solution to your financial problems. Here we'll talk about the three C's of great financial education. Then, the third and most important is that you learn how to achieve financial freedom. We'll discuss the specific steps you'll have to go through in order to win in the game of wealth. This is a loaded seminar, so before we begin, let me just remind you that if you want to absorb 100% of the lessons, you'll have to give your 100% attention as well. So please close other windows, turn your phone on silent, and make sure you don't have any distractions. With that said, let's get started. Part 1. Understanding the problem. Why are so many people struggling financially? In order to answer this question, let me tell you a story. A student took an exam. When they got the test papers back, he failed. So when he got home, his mom asked him, Anak, bakit ka bumagsak? The student answered, Kasi mahirap po yung test. Hindi tinanggap nung nanay ang sagot. Kaya tinanong niya ulit yung anak niya, Anak, bakit ka bumagsak? The student answered, Kasi po hindi magaling magturo yung teacher. The mom didn't accept the answer again. Medyo naiinis na nga si nanay, kaya nag-English na siya at tinawag ng buong pangalan ng kanyang anak. Julius Tolentino de la Cruz, stop giving me excuses. Why did you fail the exam? The student, finally understanding na hindi siya makakalusot, finally said, Ma, kasi hindi po ako nag-aral. The game of wealth is the same. How we earn, how we use, how we spend, and how we invest our money is all an exam. Give the right answer, and you'll be financially rewarded. Give the wrong answer, and you'll have financial problems. This is why it is important to study money. Because if you do not study money, if you do not understand how the game of wealth works, how will you know the difference between the right and wrong answer? Let's say that you receive a salary of 20,000 pesos a month. How do you spend it? How will you budget it? Do you even have a budget? Among all the things you want to buy and have to pay for, what will you pay for first? Let's say you earn a bonus of 100,000 pesos. What would you do with it? Put it in the bank? Buy a new entertainment system? Ipang advance payment sa utang? Ipang tayo ng small business? Ilagay sa stock market? Ipadala sa kamag-anak na nangangailangan. Ano ang gagawin mo? Let's say a personal finance advisor is selling you insurance and investments. What kind of insurance do you get? Whole? Term? VUL? How much insurance should you get? Should you get other insurance riders? You get invited to see a business proposal. Is it a scam? Is it even legal? Or is it a good idea? Every day, we play the game of wealth. And we are continuously tested how you answer will determine your financial results. Remember the following rule of money. Our financial struggles, problems, and worries are caused by making bad financial decisions. And what causes bad financial decisions? Knowing the wrong things about money. On the other hand, our financial successes, financial freedom, 
and financial abundance is caused by making good money decisions. And what makes good money decisions? It's about knowing the right things about money. Financial education. The more you know about money, the better your decisions and the better off you'll be financially. That is why it is important to study money and to make yourself financially educated. Money is important, therefore it should be studied. I know this firsthand because at a very young age, I have always dreamed of retiring young and retiring comfortably. And so high school pa lang, I have started to read financial books. I read books about investing even if I didn't have money to invest. I read about books on how to get out of debt even if wala naman akong utang. How to start a business kahit wala naman akong kapital. I attended seminars about training courses. I consumed it all. Lahat ng pwedeng basahin tungkol sa pera binasa ko at ang mga pwedeng attend na seminar, pinuntahan ko rin. I just kept learning and learning and I continue to learn about money. In other words, I made it a point to make myself financial financially educated. And so, upon entering the real world, pagkatapos ko mag-graduate from college, I had a pretty good financial education. And so, I was able to play the game of wealth very well. In my first job, even though my salary was delayed for six long months. By the way, this was in a government institution and ganun kahaba yung processing ng papeles kaya siya na-delay ng ganun katagal. Anyway, I managed to survive without having to go into debt or without asking money from my parents. And with a salary of less than 20,000 pesos a month, I was able to build a six figure investment in the stock market. That investment, I was able to grow at 30% per year. Take note, walang laban ang 1-2% to interest ng banko dito. At the same time, I have been consistent in giving at least 10% of what I earn to charity. After two years in my job, I resigned, started a business, and grew it to replace my income and more. Today, I am living on what you would call passive income. Whether I work or not, I still earn money. But of course, I still choose to work because I love what I do and I earn from it. Oh, last but not the least, I just turned 26 as I'm making this video. Now, I'm sharing this with you, not to boast. Hindi po ako nagyayabang. I know that I have a lot more to learn and experience in life. I only share with you what I have been able to do in order to show you the value of financial education and what it can do for you. Kasi I am particularly not that intelligent. Wala naman akong honors nung nag-graduate. I'm also not known to be hardworking kasi kung pwedeng hindi gawin, ay sus, hindi ko talaga yun gagawin. At hahanap ako ng paraan para hindi ko siya gawin. So, I consider myself to be just average. But the reason why I have above average financial results is because of financial education. Nothing more and nothing less. Okay? With that, let's go to part two. Now you already know that the problem is a lack of financial education. So let's go to the solution. The plain and simple solution is to get great financial education. Take note, I said great financial education. Hindi naman kasi pwede yung lumabas ka na lang sa bahay at magtanong, paano ba mag-invest? Paano ba mag-ipon? Paano ba umaman? It doesn't work that way. In order to get great financial education, you need to keep in mind the three C's. Okay? The education you get must be correct, clean, and comprehensive. We'll talk about each one very quickly. First, correct. Make sure that what you're learning is correct. Kasi actually lahat naman tayo ay informally educated tungkol sa pera. Since we didn't learn it from school, we learned about money through our parents, relatives, friends, the telenovela, and the news. Unfortunately, what we often learn from these sources are wrong. And so some people have crazy beliefs about money. So for example, the only way to become rich is to win the lotto. Okay? This belief just doesn't make any mathematical sense because your chances of winning the lotto is less than 0. 0.000001. And if the lotto is the only way to become wealthy, then only 0.000001% of the population should be rich. But that's not the case. 5 to 10% of the population are wealthy. This means they must be doing something else which isn't the lotto. Okay, another crazy belief. The safest place to put your money in is in the bank. Okay, this one is actually very sad. Kasi sa banko, 1% per year lang ang kinikita ng pera mo. May withholding tax pa. Pero ang pagmahal ng bilihin, ang inflation, ay naglalaro sa 3 to 10% per year. So lugi ka talaga. I can't imagine how people can say that the bank is the safest place to put your investment. Hindi lang tulog yung pera mo, binabangungot pa dahil sa inflation. And 
this is the reason why it's good to learn how to invest in bonds, how to invest in the stock market. Now, one more crazy belief, and this is very common with the younger generation, that the way to become rich is to save money for capital and then start a business. Why is this belief crazy? It's because 90% of small businesses fail within the first year and 95% fails within the next five years. So imagine that you'll be saving money for several years and 90% of the time, you lose it all within the first year. Parang may mali nga naman dun, di ba? So what's the right belief? When it comes to business, your time shouldn't be spent saving up for capital. Instead, it should be spent on increasing your business acumen, marketing, sales, logistics, HR, the best practices of the industry you're in. Nandun dapat ang focus. For aspiring entrepreneurs, at the beginning, a business has little to do with being at the right time and the right place and, you know, having the right opportunity. But it's all about being the right person to take advantage of that opportunity. Okay? And marami pang ibang crazy beliefs tungkol sa pera. Marami ay mali, marami naman ay outdated na. But all of these crazy beliefs have one thing in common. They can all prevent you from achieving financial freedom. Ang dami ng perang nasasayang dahil mali ang natutunan tungkol sa pera. Again, remember, wrong education leads to bad financial decisions which leads to financial struggles and problems. But the correct education would lead to good financial decisions and will lead you to financial freedom and abundance. So, where do you get correct financial education? Well, you can only get them from experts. This would be through books and seminars or by being personally coached by them. Again, from books, seminars, or personal coaching. Don't get financial education from nanay, tatay, tito, or tita, BFFs, or frenemies unless you consider them to be financially successful already. Don't get financial education from telenovelas, from the kapitbahay, from the news, unless they themselves are experts on the topic of money. Get them only from books, seminars, and people you consider to be financially successful. So, that's it for the first C, correct education. The next C is you must look for clean education. Okay, what does clean financial education mean? This simply means that the person you're learning from must have no conflict of interest. What do I mean by this? A very quick example on this are some insurance and investment agents. They call themselves financial planners, wherein they are really just sales agents. They will give you financial advice, financial planning, and financial education. But the end point of that is para bumili ka ng produkto sa kanila. And from the transaction, they would earn their commission. Now, there is nothing wrong with this. After all, it's great if more people are educated when it comes to finance. However, sometimes, and please take note, I said sometimes, there would be cases wherein there would be a conflict of interest. The best product for the customer, the best product for you, isn't the one that would give them the highest commission possible. And on a few occasions, even if the customer doesn't need the product, the agent would still recommend it just to get a commission. And this is a way on how financial education can become dirty. Again, before we move on, please take note that not all insurance agents are like this. Meron naman talagang iilan who will really give you good advice and put your priorities ahead of theirs. So, I am not saying to not listen to insurance agents and investment agents. Rather, you need to take the additional step to validate if what they are saying to you, if what they are teaching to you is indeed correct. So, that's it for the second C, clean financial education. Let's now go to the last C, comprehensive financial education. What this means is that whatever you're learning, you should always be able to understand how it helps you in the bigger picture. The world of money is actually very huge with many topics. There's budgeting, spending, earning money, investments, the regulations, you have stocks, bond, real estate, franchising, precious metals, and so many more. It's very possible that you get overwhelmed with what you're learning. And so, when that happens, you could get stuck and give up. Now, of course, hindi natin gusto yung mangyari. And the solution to this is to always understand the big picture of your journey to financial freedom. Comprehensive financial education is actually harder to get because people, most of the time, only share their personal experiences. For example, if you're learning from someone 
who became wealthy from real estate, then that person will tell you that the path to wealth is through real estate. But if you're learning from a person who became wealthy from the stock market, then what will he say to you? He will say to you that the path to wealth is through the stock market. And then if you ask a person who became wealthy from living below their means and by means of investing, then he will tell you to do the same. Magtiped at maginvest. And if you go ask a priest on how to become truly wealthy, he will say to you that it is by repentance and getting to know God. Diba? This is what is happening. Now, everyone has their own perspectives and maraming mali, marami rin namang tama. But always remember that there are a lot of ways to become wealthy. And let me be very straight with you right now. If in your mind, tingin mo ngayon na makitid at kakaunti lang talaga ang paraan para yumaman, then it means you are not yet seeing the big picture. Now let me emphasize again on the importance of the big picture. It is important to see the big picture so you can choose the best path for yourself to become wealthy. Let me emphasize the words, best path for yourself. Kasi iba-iba naman tayo ng sitwasyon sa buhay. We have different resources, different upbringing, different skills, passions, and talents. And you know, we have different lives. And so the best paths for us are also different. You have to see the big picture so you know your options. And Choose the best one, not the best path for everyone else, but the best path for you, specifically you. This is what I mean by comprehensive financial education. So that's it for the three C's of good financial education. It has to be correct, meaning you learn from the experts. Then it has to be clean, meaning there's no conflict of interest. Then it has to be comprehensive, meaning it shows you the big picture. Okay, so you're probably wondering right now, where can you get this kind of correct, clean, and comprehensive financial education? Actually, the first two C's, correct and clean, that's very easy to find. Just avoid learning from people who have a lot of opinions but no track record and just stick to learning from the books and seminars of experts. The harder part is to get the comprehensive financial education because that would mean you would have to study from different people and learn different topics. Personally, getting comprehensive financial education took me four years to get and I'm still learning. Reading hundreds of books and attending multiple seminars, it was not just a long period of time, it was also very, very expensive. And so this is one of the reasons why I felt that I had to make the Game of Wealth online seminar. This is an online seminar that I personally created wherein I will comprehensively teach you how to win in the Game of Wealth. Now, before I give you the details of the Game of Wealth training program, I know that I promised you three sections to this video. Part one was about why people are struggling financially and you learned there that it was because of a lack of financial education. And in part two, we talked about what kind of financial education you should be looking for. So it should be correct, clean, and comprehensive. So what's left is part three wherein we'll take on how to become wealthy. So I'll discuss this part alongside the contents of the Game of Wealth training program because the contents of the program actually discuss the steps on how to become financially free and financially abundant. So whether or not you decide to get this program or, or not, pay attention to the outline because you will have to learn it one way or another if you want to win in the Game of Wealth. Again, pay attention to the outline because whether you decide to get the Game of Wealth online seminar or not, you will have to learn the topics anyway if you want to achieve financial freedom and abundance. So let's get started with part three, how to become wealthy. There are seven stages you have to be great at in order to achieve financial freedom and financial abundance. And these seven stages are what we will also go through in the journey to wealth. These same stages are what we play in the game of wealth. And these same seven stages are the core modules in the game of wealth training program. So what are the seven stages? Stage one is the stage of awareness. This is all about the psychology of wealth and how your beliefs about money can actually prevent you from becoming wealthy. So, may kakilala ka ba na parang hindi ganun ka-motivated mag-succeed sa buhay? Yung tipong maligaya na sa pwede na? Well, that actually has a lot to do with the psychology of wealth. This is the starting point of wealth building. Kasi if subconsciously ayaw ng tao yumaman, talagang hindi siya yayaman. Overcoming these psychological barriers is what we will focus on in the stage of awareness. Next, 
Stage two, the stage of the quicksand. This is the stage of people who are buried in debt. Mga lubog sa utang at hirap ng bayaran ang interest. To succeed in this stage, you will need to learn about how to get out of debt. How to ask help from the right people, ask the right thing, and ask the right way. This is also about learning how to defend yourself from collection agencies. If you are buried in debt, I understand that feeling of being overwhelmed by everything. So what you will learn in this section will be how to get out of debt and how to take control of your life again. If you're not in the stage of the quicksand, then meaning hindi ka lubog sa utang, that's good. But it is absolutely important to stay away from this stage of staying away from bad debt. You'll be able to do this by understanding how loans and how interests work. The concept of principal, interest, compounding, and leverage. Borrowing money kasi, it's like crossing a very busy highway. You have to know where to look, when to start, and when exactly to stop. Next. Stage three is the stage of burdens. This stage is all about earning money. The people who are in this stage are people who can't support themselves yet. Basically, mga taong kulang ang income for their day-to-day -day expenses. Yung sobrang gipit ang budget. And, you know, to succeed in this stage, you have to understand the principles of making money. So in this stage, you'll discover the most important rule of earning money. Now, ayo ko naman mong detent. So here's the rule. Money is a byproduct of value provided. Whenever there's value provided, there is money. So, sa simpleng salita, if you want to earn more money, you have to provide more value to others. The whole stage comprehensively discusses this concept. And if you fully understand it, it will be easy to make money from any place, anyone, from anything, anytime. By fully appreciating this concept, napakadali nang kumita ng pera. Then, stage four is the stage of independence. This stage is where people are already comfortable. They are able to support themselves financially. However, they are not yet secure in their future. So, they live on paycheck to paycheck. Wala ngang utang, pero wala din namang savings. Isang bagyo lang, isang trahedya lang, lulubog bigla sila sa utang. That's why for this topic, we will talk about how to protect yourself and how to protect your money. You will learn saving techniques that will make saving pain-free and easy. This is perfect for people who are NSSB or yung mga no savings since birth. You'll also learn about insurance, how it works, and what kind to get. I'll be revealing common sales strategies used by insurance agents to get you to buy their products that are more expensive but are also unnecessary. And you know, when you get the right kind of insurance, sobrang laki ng matitipid mo. Then, one more big topic in the stage of independence is the world of investments. You'll learn about mutual funds, UITFs, equities, stocks, bonds, time deposits, and many others. You see, one of the reasons kung bakit napaka-confusing ng mga investments is because many financial institutions give branded names to their investment products like the Strategic Growth Ultimate Legacy Tree Dynamic Fund. Okay, I'm making this up. Pero branding an investment product, it's good for marketing purposes. Pero when it comes to consumer education, it's just plain confusing. Tapos, dagdagan mo pa ng mga sobrang daming fine print with tables of a lot of numbers. Hi, kawawa naman ang average consumer. That's why in this module, I will spend a lot of time to help you understand these investment proposals. So, we will talk about the key things you should look for. And most importantly, I will teach you how to decide if the investment is for you or not. If it's aligned with your financial goals, kung kailangan mo ba talaga siya. This is actually one of the longest parts of the training. And many of those who have already gone through this training said that with this module alone, kahit lang dito sa topic na to, sulit na sulit na yung tuition na binayad nila. Okay? Next. The next stage is stage 5, the stage of security. This is the stage where people are already secure in their past, present, and future needs. 
and reaching this stage means that you are already a winner in the game of wealth. Panalo ka na. But the game of wealth is not yet over because you can still work on ways so that you can retire early and detach yourself from having to work for money. This stage is going to be about building passive income. To succeed in this stage, you'll need to know about real estate, advanced investing, and business. You'll also learn about online businesses, franchising, and networking. There are many ways of achieving financial freedom. And when you're starting out, you have to be familiar with all of them so you know which kind of business would best fit your personal situation. One concept that I discussed lengthily in the Game of Wealth training program has actually been mentioned earlier. And that's the concept of too many aspiring entrepreneurs looking for the right businesses. No, they wait for the right timing and the right opportunity. Actually, tama naman yun. But they always forget to evaluate if they are the right persons for the business. Ang tawag actually dito ay yung concept ng business sweet spot. And kahit gaano kaganda ang isang negosyo, kapag wala ito sa business sweet spot mo, then you will fail. That's why when you evaluate businesses based on the business sweet spot, you will no longer waste your time on pursuing the wrong kinds of businesses. This can literally save you a lot of time, a lot of money, and a lot of emotional distress that comes along with failing. Then, stage six, the stage of financial freedom. This is where the champions of the game play. These are for people who are already totally free from the worries of money. And because they have already conquered the game of wealth, they can now focus on the game of life. And it's all about living a fulfilling life where you are unconstrained and unlimited by money. Then the last stage in the game of wealth is stage seven, the stage of financial abundance. This stage is all about how to give so you can succeed. There are actually rules of giving money. And if you don't follow the rules of giving, you can end up being taken advantage of by other people. Maraming Pilipino pa naman ang mahilig magpamartir. So to succeed in this stage, you need to develop the skills of giving, how to give with self-respect, how to give with open hands, and how to give in multiple languages. In this stage, you'll learn the right way to give so you can keep on giving abundantly. And so these are the seven stages in the game of wealth. And these are also the things you will learn inside the Winning the Game of Wealth online seminar. I'm sharing the whole framework to you now because whether or not you buy the Game of Wealth training, you are going to have to learn these skills anyway if you want to become wealthy, if you want to reach financial abundance, okay? So by now, you're probably wondering, how much does the training cost? We will get to that in a while. Let me just give you a warning. As someone who has gone through a lot of financial books, seminars, and courses, I can say to you from personal experience that if you were to try and learn these concepts correctly and comprehensively on your own without any other help, it would take you more than 30,000 pesos and more than 100 hours trying to understand what it is you're learning. Ngayon, hindi naman ako nananakot. If you're thinking, Wow, J3, is the world of money really that complicated that I need to spend a hundred hours or more just to learn it? The answer is no. The world of money is actually very simple. The hard part is finding good teachers who can simplify it and explain it to you very well. Kasi sad to say, there are seminars out there na yung speakers ay very entertaining at puro patawa, pero kulang naman sa substance. So you remember all the jokes, but you still don't know how to become wealthy. Nagsine ka na lang sana. And sometimes the speakers are really topic experts, pero hindi magaling sa communication skills. So, sobrang boring, wala ka rin maintindihan, natulog ka na lang sana. And worst of all, the speakers who spend so much time selling you on other products rather than teach you the real stuff, 
You know when you paid for a half day seminar and the speaker spends half the time telling you to buy their more advanced seminars. Hi nako. I'm warning you now because this is what I have been through. I've been there and I've wasted my money on them. So remember, your risk if you try and learn this stuff on your own is at least 30,000 pesos and over a hundred hours of your time. This is the risk that I can take away from you if you choose to enroll in the Winning the Game of Wealth online seminar today. So how much is the tuition fee? To get one-on-one -on -one coaching from me, I charge a minimum of 15,000 pesos per client. Basically, I handhold them on how to apply the concepts for winning the game of wealth to their own unique financial status. But since this is an online seminar, which is meant to cater to everyone, I can offer it at a much more discounted price of 7,000 pesos. When you buy the training program, you're going to get exclusive lifetime online access to the training videos for the seven stages of wealth. That's more than seven hours of pure content, pure training, including the worksheets and activities and even more training. You can access this training anytime, anywhere for life. And yes, you can also download the videos. This means each topic will be comprehensively discussed and you will know exactly what to do with your money so that you will achieve financial freedom and abundance. Let me share with you a few testimonials given by other Filipinos who have already enrolled in this seminar. Arnel Caparino said, It's great and inspiring. Yung mga points ng lesson mo, understandable sa mga ordinary people. Yun kasi ang dapat. Majority kasi sa atin ay average and below average ang estado sa buhay. Awesome seminar. Thanks, Sir J3. Another student of mine named Ben emailed this unsolicited testimonial to me. Hi, J3. I finished watching all the videos over the weekend. Thank you so much for the super simple ways of presenting each topic. I'm sure anyone from any profession can understand the topics thanks to you. I have to be honest, there was a point where I wanted to share the videos with others to help them increase their financial literacy. But then I realized since they will be watching it for free, there is a tendency that they will not value the things you taught. So what I've been doing is sharing your five pillars of wealth videos. It's up to them to decide whether or not they'll buy your seminar presentation. But hopefully they will. Oh, and thank you for the comments on this specific product here. I can't share this with you right now. So Dan continues, you are one of the few people who cleared my view on this. More power to you. Blessings, Dan. Actually, all of the students inside the game of wealth praise that about the training. Na it's very clear, very understandable. Na ang dami-dami na nilang binabasa dati, ang dami na nilang inatendan, pero ngayon lang nila talaga naintindihan kung ano ba ang dapat nilang gawin in order to achieve financial freedom. Okay, now let's go back to your investment of 7,000 pesos for this seminar. You see, here is an ironic and weird thing about people and money. Because the people who need financial education the most are the same people who cannot afford to pay 7,000 pesos for their financial education. So if game ka na bumili at 7,000 pesos right now, chances are you are at least in the stage of independence and you can manage your day-to-day -day expenses and have some savings. But the more you feel na ang mahal naman ng tuition fee, then most likely you are in a bad financial state and you badly need to enroll in this seminar. So you can start turning your life around as early as tonight. That's why to make this training more accessible to those who need it the most for a very limited time, I will make the whole Winning the Game of Wealth online seminar available for a one-time investment of 2000 975 pesos. And remember, when you invest today, you will get lifetime access to the seminar, meaning you can watch it over and over and over again at the convenience of your own home for no extra charge. Just a one-time payment of 2,975 pesos. Click on the buy button below this video to lock in this discounted price. Now, at this point, I would like to answer the frequently asked questions about this program. First question, 
Sulit kaya itong seminar for 2,975 pesos? Siyempre, nakakatawa naman kung ako ang sumagot nito, di ba? Siyempre, sasabihin kong sulit. <laughs> so, I let one of my wealthier students answer it for you. Here's what Mylene Garcia said. Hi, J3. I'm already done with the seminar. I love it. Modesty aside, I am already in the stage of security. I thought the other slides would bore me since I'm already on the upper stages in the game of wealth. But I'm glad I still listen to all your videos. I have learned a lot more. What I like most about it is the video on how to get out of that. I'm so blessed that I was never in that situation. So I don't have an, any idea how to help people who's on that stage. Now I know better. Thank you so much. My purchase was definitely worth it. More power, J3. Sincerely, Mylene. So Mylene is a student who is already in the stage of security, meaning complete na ang kanyang investments, prepared na siya for retirement. She's already a winner in the game of wealth. One step away na lang siya from financial freedom. And yet, she said, my purchase was definitely worth it. So, if sulit siya para sa mga financially secure na, what more pa para sa mga taong lubog sa utang or walang kahit anong savings or yung nagsisimula pa lang mag-invest? Think about it. And I believe that answers your question if sulit ba yung seminar. Okay, next question that may be on your mind. J3, baka naman pinili mo lang yung mga pinakamagagandang testimonials at yun yung nilagay mo dito sa video. Or what if sulit para kay Mylene, pero when I buy, eh hindi naman pala sulit. That's a very valid question. That's why when you enroll in the Winning the Game of Wealth online seminar, it will include a full 30-day 100% money-back guarantee. Meaning, once you purchase the program, and you go through all the videos and all the resources, and at the end of it, for whatever reason, you decide that it's not worth it, just tell me and I will give you your money back. No, just email me and tell me with integrity that, J3, it wasn't worth it, and I will give you 100% of your money back, no questions asked. That's how much I believe in the quality of this training program. And let me just share with you, you know, this program has been going on for a couple of years already. Do you know how many people have asked for a refund? Zero. Nada. None. Zilch. Each and every student absolutely loved the seminar. But hey, if for any reason you don't think it's worth it, then I will refund your full investment. Walang tanong-tanong. It doesn't matter if you're the first Sure, I'll be sad dahil my first unsatisfied student ako, but I only want to keep your money if you are happy with your investment. By doing this, I know that I'm exposing myself to people who will take advantage of this guarantee. Mga tao now will go through the program, find it really helpful, but still get a refund. But it's okay. I'm willing to take on that risk just so that you can start moving forward financially. I'm willing to take on that risk because... I know that this program will truly help you change your financial life. So again, if you're ready for financial progress, just click on the buy button below and start winning the game of wealth. Next question. Am I getting anything else aside from the core training videos? Yes, I'm going to give you three great bonuses. Here is your first bonus. In addition to the core training videos, you'll be given access to the Q&A vault. What is this? Diba kapag mag-attend ka ng live seminar, laging may Q&A portion? So we will do the same here. Basically, you send in your questions via email, I'll collect them and create a video answering all of them. And since we're doing this online, I have unlimited time to answer all of your questions. Hindi tulad sa live seminar na 15 to 30 minutes lang. Here, we can take even one, an hour, two hours just answering your questions. Now, I call it the Q&A vault. Because all previous Q&A sessions will also be available for your viewing. Additionally, yung mga bagong Q&A sessions, it will be released every three to six months depending on the volume of questions that the members send in. And again, you will have lifetime access to these bonus Q&A videos at no extra cost. And just so you know the real value of this, let me share with you another testimonial from Krishnan Rodriguez. And he said, Hello, Mentor J3. 
thank you for covering two of my questions from your Q&A session. Indeed, it was very informative, especially about the VUL and estate planning. Actually, I didn't expect that you will cover it again with a second session as no una pa lang, I really got a deep understanding on how it works na. But thanks, I'll submit more questions soon if I have one. And just to share, nung una pa lang na makita ko yung tutorial mo, introducing yourself for five minutes and your site via YouTube, I felt great. What I like is you're very vibrant and full of enthusiasm. Tipong I can see your face in my mind and all the gestures with even just hearing your voice. Your analogies are the best. Nandiyan ang scenarios and real-life situation examples for us newbies to understand it better. The tutorials are easy to understand, friendly in a way na pang masa siya kasi mas madali intindihin para sa nakarami compared to others like investment books na mahirap unawain. Keep it up, J3. Keep us financially educated. Thanks. So, this Q&A vault, it's my way of making sure that you really understand every aspect of the game of wealth. And you will get access to this for free when you enroll in the Winning the Game of Wealth seminar today. Just click on the buy button below to get started. Okay, first bonus yun. Now, the second bonus is that you will be invited to join the Game of Wealth graduates, a secret and exclusive Facebook group full of members who are just like you, fellow Filipinos who are taking responsibility for their financial destiny. You can post your shorter questions here and other members can give you answers. And from time to time, ako mismo sumasagot doon. Ito yung mga para sa mga questions na mabilisan lang naman sagutin. And this bonus actually has a psychological benefit for you where you'll know that you are not alone in your struggles. You have support and when you succeed, you will have people to celebrate it with. Then, the third and last bonus, it's my favorite. It's the Game of Wealth Resource Guide. This is a list and review of all the resources, books, seminars, TV shows, websites, and other resources that have allowed me personally to win the game of wealth. If you want to expand your learning further, this is a definite must because you'll be able to separate the resources that are great versus the ones that are just good and the ones na eh, sayang sa pera. So you know you're putting your money to good use if you invest in these other learning resources. So. These three bonuses, the Q&A vault, access to the Game of Wealth graduates group, and the Game of Wealth resource guide are all for free when you enroll in the Winning the Game of Wealth online seminar. You will get lifetime access for a one-time payment of 2,975 pesos. Click on the buy button below right now to get started. Okay, one last question I'll be answering in this video. Can I buy this program some other time? Pag-isipan ko muna. Okay, a lot of marketing people are going to hate me for this, but you deserve to know the truth. At this point in the video, it is a common marketing strategy to say that registration is limited. Na kunwari, 10 seats na lang ang natitira before registration closes. Ang iba ginagawa nila, naglalagay ng fake timer when this deal will expire and so on. It's a well-known marketing strategy that when you push on a person's urgency, sales can increase by as much as 100%. Doble! That's why almost all marketers will give you a fake sense of urgency just to get you to buy now, buy now. This strategy works because psychologically, we have a fear of losing an opportunity. But I don't want to give you a false sense of urgency just to pressure you into buying. Instead, I just want to be brutally honest with you with what you have been through. Ilang taon ka na ba nagtatrabaho? At sa tagal nun, magkano nang naipon mo? Are you financially prepared when an emergency strikes you or a member of your family? Handa ka na ba para sa education ng mga anak o para sa retirement mo? Do you have an idea on when you would be able to retire? At hindi yung retirement na magiging pabigat ka lang sa iba. Do you already have a retirement account? What will your children inherit from you? Will it be a house, isang negosyo, good values about money, o ang mamamana ba nila ay utang, obligasyon, or negativity about the world? Ikaw lang ang makakasagot ng mga tanong na yan. I just want you to be honest with yourself. And if you postpone getting the Game of Wealth seminar, your answers today, yung mga sagot sa tinanong ko sa'yo, your answers will be the same tomorrow. 
yung mga financial problems mo, yung financial struggles mo, yung financial worries mo, you still won't know how to deal with them. You still won't know how to solve them. Ikaw lang ang nakakaalam ng pinagdaanan mo. At kung wala kang gagawing bago, yun at yun pa rin ang pagdadaanan mo. Bukas, one month from now, a year from now, and possibly for the rest of your life, nako, wag naman sana. The reality is, if you don't make a move to change your life today, how can you expect your tomorrow to be better? My dear Kababayan, price is no longer a barrier. I already took the risk for you with a full 100% money back guarantee. And yung 2,975 pesos na yan, alam natin pareho na matagal nang dumaan pa ulit, 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 ulit sa kamay mo yung halaga na yan. Pero kailan mo siya ginamit para baguhin ang buhay mo? You now have that opportunity. Let me help you win the game of wealth. Click on the buy button below right now and I will see you inside.